But what if the sun just turned off for one second? You won't notice, of course, because between the sun and us, there are 150 million kilometers and eight minutes of delay. It's like someone unplugging your router in your basement, but you only find out eight minutes later when the video freezes. But it's only a second. What can happen in a second? Answer. Physics is not joking. At the moment when the sun goes out, nothing happens in the universe because the information about the event is still on its way. Everything goes on as usual, just a little bit doomed. On Earth, everything is going as usual. People are drinking coffee, planes are flying, photosynthesis is pumping out oxygen. And no one suspects that in eight minutes, the scientific apocalypse will begin. And so, exactly eight minutes and 20 seconds pass. And suddenly, everything goes dark. Instantly. No sunrise, no sunset. Just pop, as if the universe blinked. Photosynthesis stops. Plant cells panic. Where is the photon? Who turned off the light? The animals are confused. The birds are silent. The dogs are barking at the sky. Some owls are starting their morning exercises. Even the cockroaches are unsure whether to come out. And the scientists are like, oh, looks like we're down one photon and a million questions. A second later, the sun is already on again. The light is coming to us again. We don't know yet that it blinked, but space knows. The orbits are starting to go crazy. Gravity is not instantaneous either. It moves at the speed of light. This means that all planets lose their connection with the sun for a split second. It's as if someone pulled their leash. Jupiter is slightly off kilter, very slightly. But when you weigh two quintillion tons, that's not slightly. It's wow. Now imagine, billions of bodies all over the solar system, all felt freedom for a millisecond, and then immediately returned, like a herd that was allowed to step aside. We call it a one-second touch of chaos. Everything seems to be back, but the universe is now a little confused. Astronomers are the first to react. Their telescopes suddenly detect a dip in brightness. The program issues an alarming message, S-U-N, possibly reset. Then there are the power systems. Some solar stations suddenly lose power. Someone thinks, probably a bird landed on the panel. Number, it was the sun. In the cities, everything looks normal. But some people feel that something is wrong. A moment of loss, not of light, but of confidence. And then the theories come out. Forums explode. The sun glitched. It was an alien AI test. I definitely saw it blink. Governments are silent. Scientists pretend that this is how it should be. And inside, everyone is very quietly wondering, what if this wasn't a glitch, but a warning? Scientists compare data. They come to the conclusion, the sun really did turn off, but for one second, and only light, not gravity, as if someone rebooted the core. Physicists ask the ultimate question, is it possible to turn off a thermonuclear reaction for one second and then turn it back on? The answer is no, but it's still very interesting. Astrologers go on air. They say, the sun blinked. It's a sign of the renewal of the universe, and they get three million likes. Religious leaders declare, the lights have gone out. To remind us, everything is not in our hands. And launch the Divine Ray, NFT. And one programmer creates a website called didthesunblink.com. He writes, if you're reading this, then no. Not yet. Safety tips updated. In case of repeated blinking, keep a flashlight, food supplies, and don't look at the sky too confidently. Scientists are building a prototype, an artificial sun, in case the natural one gets tired again. Politicians propose building a protective cover over the sun, so that if something happens, you won't forget to turn it back on. But all this is later. And for now, somewhere, someone is simply looking at the sun again. And it shines just as if nothing had happened. It was only a second, but now we know that even light can disappear. And that's why we begin to appreciate it more.